Hello, this is Bern, and if you've ever asked yourself the question, can I make a guy want me? Can I make a guy desire me? Well, you'd be surprised at the answer, and on today's episode, I will be revealing that and a few other things that can make a significant difference in your ability to attract what you want. So stick with me. Hello, this is Bern. Welcome to your great life tv.com. Today's another edition of Get the Love You Crave. On today's episode, my dear, I'm going to be sharing with you the answer to the question, can I make a guy want me or desire me? The answer, the, the specific, just two word, an, one word answer is no, you can't make him want you, but you can certainly inspire him to do so. And because the way we do things, in the in attracting soulmates is more of an attraction force than a I'm gonna make him do it force then it's to your benefit that you can make him and to your benefit that you can actually create that force of attraction step number one or hint number one I'll say if you want to understand the formula for attraction one formula I don't claim to have the only formula but one formula for attraction would be openness okay openness of use of woman body heart soul openness plus inner light equals attraction. Think about it in other terms, not even male, female. Think about this in terms of a flower. You're walking down your city and you see a beautiful open flower with a glow. You stop in your tracks. It pulls you in. It forces you to stop thinking and connect even if for a brief moment to your heart. The same thing is true with a beautiful inside out woman who is open and who has that intensity fire coming through. That is incredibly attractive and that will make a baby or a 90 year old man stop in their tracks and why? Because it's the force of creation, it's the force that moves this earth and it's the opposite of thinking and the opposite of doing, it's being and that being is attractive to the masculine. Second hint, since we're talking about light, is a source of light that is self-ignited is exponentially more attractive than a force of source of light that needs something else to light up on the inside. Why? Because the source of light that's self-ignited is going to shine regardless. It's far more attractive to see and witness something that is awesome whether you like it or not then something that will only feel awesome if you say the right word say the right phrase treat it a certain way i'm not saying that that can get even shinier because it does the feminine lights up even more through that presence and praise and recognition but you want to be the kind of like the sun you want to be like the sun that uh, y- you don't need for somebody to tell you that you're awesome for you to feel awesome you don't need for a man to tell you you're beautiful to know in your heart that you're beautiful the more self-ignited you are the more attractive and the more valuable you become to the eyes of an intelligent and worthy man (laughs) number three if you want to create that force of attraction with a man if you want to inspire him and influence him versus make him want you, is be in touch with and embracing of your body. In touch with means that you are fully present in your body, that you are connected to your senses. Sensuality comes from connecting to your senses, right? It's not just expressing yourself sexually, it's connecting to your senses. So you're feeling, tasting, smelling. You are that expressiveness. You are that force of feeling so if you're in touch with your body and you embrace it and you feel confident in it that goes back to the first thing i shared it's part of openness but it adds an element of sensuality and sexual attraction and sexual polarity and sexual tension that is very hard for a guy not to notice very hard for a guy not to feel pulled towards so you want to make sure that you are confident, connected with, and embracing of your body, embracing of your curves, embracing of, if you don't have any curves, embracing of of your muscles, whatever you have right now, that you are so in touch with it, and you're so comfortable, and you present yourself in a way that is expressive because you understand and accept what you have. Number four, 
And this is something that may be counterintuitive to everything else that I'm sharing with you, but you see that it's really not. It's you want to create a stronger force of pull of attraction with guys. You need to be able to stand your ground more firmly based on what you believe and you know to be true. That really translates to hold stronger boundaries so that the man that you're with feels a safer in knowing how much he can proceed. B understands that you are a valuable human being that needs to be treated with respect and needs to be treated with pursuit and needs to be treated in, in such a way that if you treat something as a beautiful, precious thing, then the value that you have for that is a beautiful, precious thing. If you treat something like shit, then the value that you perceive in that is like shit. And I, those are two extremes, but in the middle of those two extremes are when what you believe to be true and what boundaries you hold in every area of your life, respectful boundaries, sexual boundaries, emotional boundaries, controlling boundaries. The more you treat yourself as a queen, the more he will know to treat you as a queen. It just goes that way. Now, not every man can pull it off, but you're not looking for every man. You're looking for someone who has the insight and who has the capacity to A, feel this light that's emanating from you and B, treat it as a goddess that you are. Hope this is helpful, insightful, and useful in some way. If it is, I'm going to ask you to do three things right now. Number one, click like on this video or thumbs up. Number two, Click around here, there's a subscribe button. Just click the subscribe button so that you don't miss an episode. And you can even hit the little bell so that you're notified when new videos come out. Number three, and most important of all, on the first line of the description of this video, you'll find a link that will take you to a free training masterclass I created for you that's gonna share with you specifically how you can step into the kind of relationship that you want, how you can create a strong force of attraction, and how you can find that human being that you want to share the rest of your life with in a non-BS way. Uh, thank you so much for, for connecting with me. As I said, when you click on that link, it's going to take you to a page that has a yellow bar. Just click on the yellow bar, enter your name and email, and you'll start watching this right away. I, as always, my dear, I challenge you to live a full and a conscious life.